بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو پرائیم ایورا پروجیکٹ پلینر فور ٹیوٹوریل آئی ایم محمد قاسم شنواری اور ان دس ٹیوٹوریل وی ویل کور دی ٹاپک ڈیو بی ایس ڈیٹ ایس ہاو ٹو ڈیفائن اور دین ہاو ٹو اپلائی دی ڈیو بی ایس کارڈز ڈیو بی ایس سٹینڈز فور ورک بریک ڈاؤن سٹرکچر کارڈز So let's start. In previous video tutorial, we covered to define the successors and then how to schedule. And now we will define some WPS codes. Go to data and there click WPS. Now enter the code 1 and its title will be construction of house press enter now add the other WBS code 1.1 and its description will be design press enter now add the third one 1.1.1 and it will be its title will be honor actually we are writing the responsibilities order wise in the construction of house first of all we have to design it and in designing the first responsibility is of the owner and the second responsibility is of architect and in the design phase the third responsibility will be of contractor it's for design phase now we will add other phase that is construction phase press enter in construction phase let me delete the phase press enter in construction phase we have first responsibility is of honor oh sorry first responsibility will be of honor next will be of architect and third will be of contractor press enter similarly the third phase is of finishing and in finishing similarly 1.3.1 will be honor you can also click on the check icon instead of pressing the enter key its title will be architect and last 
last is contractor present so we have defined the WBS codes and also defined their titles click on ok now we have to apply these WBS codes to apply these codes we will see the type of activity either it's lie in design phase or it's in construction phase or is in finishing phase so you can easily detect that the D stands for design phase C stands for construction phase and F is for finishing phase and moreover we will also define either a, an activity is the responsibility of the owner or of the architect or of the contractor so let me define some WBS codes so double click on start and here in responsibility text box click in the responsibility text box and drop down button will be appeared click on this drop down button and select here owner then from here select in design phase owner click on ok highlight the second activity activate the activity form its other way of defining WBS codes in responsibility select owner and it's also the in design phase it's the responsibility of owner click on ok D0011 it's the responsibility of contractor preparation of layout is the responsibility of architect sorry and it lies in construction phase so responsibility of architect and lies in construction phase so in construction the responsibility is of architect click on ok finalize layout